that. Do you guys need to come get your yeah. paws? That's okay. They can come through. Come through, children. And go to the table. Eat your eat your ramen. You can go to the kitchen table. Go wherever you need to go. Do you need nap? Get you guys some napkins, Addison. Hey, friends. Hi, guys. It's Stephanie and Christine. Welcome to Recipe Archaeology. We're here again in my lovely kitchen. I'm liking it. It's really fun. It's 1950s. It's original. That's for sure. Mm -hmm. Um, but we're here because. Well, you'll see. So, so you've noticed things have changed a little bit this month of September at Recipe Archaeology. We've had a few audio snafus. Uh-huh. Well, a little, few little yeah, problems here and there that we've had to get creative. So this month has been really kind of fun because you've seen our reaction to what we did because a lot of our audio didn't get recorded like it should have. Right. So Oops. we've had to we've had to improvise. Yeah. So the good thing is tomato pie, most of the audio recorded, and, right. and then it didn't. <laughs> <laughs> so like halfway through, I think we got all the way to like getting it in the oven, yes, right? Yeah. All the way to getting it in the oven. Things work great. And, and then, then they, and then they stopped working. We so so we're gonna continue with this video as normal, as a normal recipe archaeology day. For the first half. And then we'll come, then you'll see us, you'll see us later on. And so we'll tell you what we thought. Yeah, so enjoy. About tonight to buy. Enjoy. Hey friends. Hi guys. It's Stephanie. And Christy. Welcome back to Recipe Archaeology. Welcome back everyone. We're here in the kitchen and we're ready to make some weird. Uh, quite a while ago we had a fan send us a few books and this precious little cookbook. Ta-da! Aunt Chick's Pies. It's so cute. Was Tell us about Aunt Chick. So Aunt Chick, um, <clears throat> she is from Tulsa, Oklahoma. 1942 is when this little booklet was published. Love it. She had a column in the Tulsa world. Is that what we said? Look at Aunt Chick Here's right Aunt there. Chick. Look at Aunt Chick. Look. Look at that happy homemaker. I trust her. I do too. I trust, I trust Aunt her. Chick. Her name is actually Mrs. Samuel Pendleton Mc McBurney. 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 Yeah, here we are where we don't have our own first names. Yeah, we don't have She had her husband's first name. Her actual first name is Nettie. Nettie! Nettie. And she says, she didn't write this because she's a missionary aspiring to rescue the digestive systems of all the husbands in the world from the undone bad pies that are being served to so many. Oh, undone bad pies. Oh, so many husbands. Bless your hearts. Sorry, husbands. Hmm. But... <laughs> Because I'm a woman, and if a woman knows anything, she must tell it. Ooh. She must Guess tell what? it. Aunt Chick? Tell her, it. Tell it. Speak, her, <laughs> speak, speak your truth. Speak your truth, Aunt, Aunt Chick. Chick. And she did. And she and did. She wrote it, it all down. Her pies. That's what she wanted. She spoke her truth, and here it is, I can 1942. Get, I can get behind it. I like her. So she's got all the different pies that you could possibly want, and she just has them list in a in a list format. And everything's labeled super simple. Um, with like a number, mm -hmm. and so you have to go. You have to look at the number, but sometimes she, under the number there's another number you have that to you reference. Have to, yeah, go back to to find the rest yeah. of your recipe. Um, in there so but it's all in there she even offers look at the pie making supplies you can purchase i really want those so on recipe archaeology we're gonna make tomato, tomato pie, pie. So yes. let me tell you how to make. Tell, tell me how we're gonna make this green tomato or regular tomato regular pie. tomato regular pie. Pie. so this is a double crust okay so i've got two um crusts uh in the fridge waiting Ready to, to be rolled out excellent okay Okay, you're gonna need um, red, diced red tomatoes. Enough to fill the pie tin. So just. It doesn't tell you how much, okay. just I, we're gonna eyeball it. We're gonna eyeball it enough to. To fill okay, our, pie, fill plate. our pie, pie plate. Okay, yeah. great. You're gonna add one and a quarter cup of sugar. Of course you are. Two tablespoons. Is that a tablespoon? Yes, ma'am. Okay, two tablespoons of minute tapioca. Which it's you a thickening have. Agent. It's a thickening agent. One teaspoon of grated rind, either orange or lemon. We kind of messed up that, mm -hmm. but we've got we've got some marmalade. We're gonna. I thought toss I had a lemon. We don't. But guess what? This is wartime cooking. Yep. 
I mean, 1942. We, and this has rind in it, so we're just going to throw a little of our rind with. It'll be fine. It'll we be, can get a teaspoon of that. It's fine. <laughs> uh, half a teaspoon of cinnamon, a quarter teaspoon of nutmeg, three tablespoons of butter, and I'm assuming we're just going to dot that on top. I assume because it doesn't say it doesn't say melted. It doesn't say. And then half a cup of raisins. How does Aunt Chick want us to do a double crust? Okay, so <clears throat> once you to first preheat your oven to 350. She did that. But then you're gonna turn your regulator up to 425 immediately. Oh. Okay. Why not just preheat to 425? I don't know, Aunt Chick. That's knows what we've done. Other um, so you're gonna set it on the lowest shelf. Okay. At 425. Okay. Bake for 25 minutes. And we're not going to blind bake this before. This it is does not, not say like... to blind bake. Bake for 25 minutes and then turn your regulator down to 350. Okay. Okay. Ha. Okay. Look at okay. the pie carefully, and if it gives an indication of being about to spew out, quote unquote, open the door for about two minutes until the Im immediate danger is over. The immediate danger, which is for it to spill out. Obviously, we're going to put something underneath it. Continue baking for about 30 minutes. Remove and cool on a wire rack. Okay. Hey, I am ready to make this. I am not looking forward to this at all in any way. I you? am. Let's make it. Let's make it. I'm going to do the dicing. I'm going to do the rolling. Here we go. I'm incorporating the raisins, which is half a cup. Yeah. Oh. Who's that? Like. Yeah, that's. Cinnamon. That's strange. And tomatoes. I'm about to put cinnamon and tomatoes. That's what Aunt Chick says. There's the nutmeg. <laughs> it's, if you haven't made marmalade biscuits yet, you should totally make marmalade biscuits, but we're gonna take all this rind out of the marmalade and we're gonna... You know what, necessity is the mother of invention. Look. Perfect! Don't you think? That's absolutely perfect. It's just said one teaspoon. It's a sweet tomato pie. The raisins are what's throwing me. Oh, I'm all that's, for it. You're until... for everything else except for the raisins. I'm, I'm in until you tell me that there's raisins in this. I am not in at all. This thing is weird as all get out. You did beautifully. Thank Look, you. that was the perfect amount. I mean. Way to go, you. What can I tell you? That was perfect. I know how to make a tomato pie. <laughs> I don't. I have no idea. Just rake her easy. Yep. And let's just crimp it together, right? Yeah. I'll let you crimp. Okay. I'll clean up over here. I'll let you. Oh, no, 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 the butter. <gasps> Look, no problem. Do half here. That was close. Was close. Oh, my gosh. That's a lovely pie crust. Okay, good. Just a simple, I... Uh, yeah, it's actually Pioneer Woman's mm -hmm. uh, Pam's Pie Crust, if you're looking for pork online. It's mm. It's mm, that tastes good. I know you're not supposed to eat raw dough. You're not. But I like it. I think that's cute. Look how cute that is. Mm, look how cute. We're also going to do an egg wash. And the egg wash. And after the first 30 minutes, I have that thing that you put around the edge. So oh, yeah, to keep it. From burning. From burning. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's do it. Let's put it in the oven. Let me go open that up for you. Oh, it's heavy. I oh, it's yes. heavy. Okay. All right. So here we are. Okay, we're this. Look, look how beautiful our it pie is. looks. It's really pretty. It's a deep dish. It is just. It's got a beautiful crust around the. It turned out. It turned out yeah. beautiful. And we had those little. We made like little little indentions to yeah. look like apple or tomatoes. Right. It was it, actually a pumpkin cutout. But it applied for a tomato cutout. I think you could 
argue that it was very similar to yes. a tomato. Yeah, so we're, we're cutting it out. I was worried about soggy bottom. And I was worried about all of this stuff sloshing the out. Goo- the goosh. Yeah, because it, it was, it was really wet it when it went in. It was really wet. Well, tomatoes are just all water. Yeah. And right? we had that tapioca in there. We did. It was, it, to... it was supposed to. It was supposed to. But look. Look at all that juice. Oh. Look. Look at all that juice. And and all the all the filling just like. Shunk. Yeah. Look. It went right into the middle, didn't yes, it? Yes. It just like. Just sloshed out. As I'm looking at that, look just at, look at those raisins. Look at those raisins. They look like blueberries mm. or something. And mm. look at look at all that. I mean, from here, if you didn't know that was tomato, you'd be like, that looks okay. But it's tomato. Yeah, you'd think it was like strawberry, Cheers. but it's not. Cheers. Okay. Oh. Mm. Mm-mm. Your brows furrowed. Your I'm, brows are furrowed. <laughs> Automatically, I'm not a fan <laughs> yeah. of what I have put into you're, my mouth. Yeah, you're not like, liking it. Mm-mm. Okay, it was. I was saying it was very sweet. It's such a. It was a weird combination because it was like that acidic tomato flavor, but very sweet. It was weird. It was really sweet, wasn't it? Yeah. It was like a. It was just. And the spice. A sweet, sweet tomato. Wait, and then the the spice with the with the. Was it cinnamon and yes. nutmeg? Yes. Excuse me. It was just like the weird apple pie spice, but with acidic tomatoes. tomatoes. And big, giant, plump raisins. And Those I, raisins plumped up. And I like a raisin, but it was like the raisin tasted of tomato, yeah. and it was weird. Yeah. And okay. I mean... Oh. Oh, look, but you, we ate all of our pie. We did because your crust was amazing. The crust was delicious. And I was really angry because we had ruined a most delicious crust with this crap filling that we put in the whole thing. <laughs> and I was really mad because crust is one of my favorite things to eat. It was delicious. Like, it was a delicious crust. I love a crust. Oh, Aunt and Chick. And Aunt Chick. Listen. No. Right? No. Yeah. Bye. So, yeah. So Aunt Chick. Bye, Aunt Chick. Bye. Yeah. The crust was great. Crust was amazing. But, and I think it was Pioneer Woman, like one of her, just sort of her basic pie crust. It was a great pie crust. It was Thank lovely. You. It Thank was you. crumbly and, and still. It was flaky. Oh, yeah. so flaky yeah. and lovely. Yeah. But you know what? No. Not for tomato pie. Not Never for tomato again. pie. Don't make tomato pie. Don't make tomato pie. That was disappointing. Yeah. Okay. Don't make it. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Yeah. <laughs> thanks, <laughs> thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching. Bye. 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 Bye.